Okay, so welcome to my new video, Camera Stand Unboxing. Okay, so let's have a look at this. I just recently purchased it for $29.90. was on promotion, usual price $29.90. This was an like, upgrade for my filming and vlogging equipment. So let's have a look at this. So okay, this product I believe is made in China. And I know the English translation here is very, very bad. Yes, mini tripod selfie. Um, okay, selfie is like selfie is a name. I'm not sure if they do they even understand that selfie is okay. Never mind. It's very comfortable while folding the legs. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, let's this behind beyond the point. And correcting the uh, bad English, but okay. This is Rinteng YT9928 tripod. Okay, so now let's open it up and take a look. Yep. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Pour out. Well. Okay, so. Yep, that's all for inside. I do not think there's anything more. Okay, so it comes with an instruction manual. A. I believe this is for phone and. This is the tripod itself, and it comes with the detachable remote control, the Bluetooth, so which means that you can use this remote control to take photos or videos on your phone. So I can take that out. Okay, so we'll go through this later. Let's see the tripod first. Okay, so here it is. Three legs. So let's open it. Because I'm holding the camera, so I only can do this on one hand. I'm trying to get this start open properly. Okay. So here it is. Okay, so this is extendable, and the top is also adjustable. Later on, I'll show you the full length at the mirror. So I'm gonna put. Anyway, this has also a mirror here to capture. To see what you are filming right here so you can use this reference if you're not using a selfie camera so let's pull this thing up and okay I'm going to lift this thing somewhere so that I can extend the entire thing up here there's three extensions so it can go up to this height yes and yeah it's done like this it's like According to the specifications, they say that this is a meter tall, but I'm not sure if it really is. We'll find out. Yep. If you can see this in comparison. So, how do we use this? Okay, here's the view from the top. So, we'll just screw the camera here. Most cameras, they have this pole right here. So, you just screw this on this screw here okay, trying to fit the thing in okay turn 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 okay okay it's done so if you want to film I recommend you to turn this with the lens facing on this side okay so which means that whatever you're seeing in the mirror here Make sure the lens and the mirror are facing the same direction. So whatever you see, the mirror here is what you are filming. Now let's switch on the camera. Okay. Okay. So currently we have switched on the camera. So let's now turn this. You can take a look at the tripod. And from this side, there's a video mode, and yay, it's working perfectly. Woo. Okay. So now. For camera, they, I don't think they have a Bluetooth remote function unless your camera, camera is Bluetooth enabled. If not, you just have to film like that. And you can also change it into a selfie stick or vlogging equipment by folding up the legs. So let me show you. So now let's bring the thing down. Switch off the camera first. Close the legs. Rotate this so that it is facing upwards, like this. Okay, straight. Now, you can fold it like this. Yay. 
that's the new vlogging equipment upgraded version Woo. okay so this is how you do the it with the camera and you can use to take selfie uh, but you can also film from a distance you can adjust but of course you have to go all the way to the buttons now let's have a look at the remote control anyway to open this increase the size you have to turn this over here and until then after that you screw it all the way on top here then you can use it as held for the phone now let's try to set up the bluetooth okay so how do we do it Okay, so here we have the remote control and the manual is um, available in both English and Chinese. So let's see. Okay, because the language used here has lots of grammatical errors, logical errors, so let's just try to make sense of it. Okay, turn the power switch to the on button. Okay, the power switch is at the side here. Okay, there's a blue light flashing. Good. So in your device go to settings general bluetooth ensure that bluetooth is on so now i'm going to oh, switch on the bluetooth on my phone okay so bluetooth on and then i go to settings and select green tone from the devices list okay so it's connected so let's see if it works. So I'm going to use this remote control in this phone and... Well... Okay, this is simply amazing because... This remote control, which is meant to take photos and zoom in and zoom out, is controlling the volume on my phone. Ooh. And... Amazingly, it can open Google on its own. I'm not sure why. Yep. Okay, Google's opening. And there's a weird sound here, okay. But this is not the purpose. So please remember to disconnect it after you're done using. So on the camera. Anyway, if you are interested in my phone, do check it check it out in one of my previous phone unboxing vlogs. And okay, done. So you can hold it like this. You can see the camera is on, so zoom in, press the plus, yes, it's working. Zoom out. And click to take a photo simple right and always remember to please just off your bluetooth and disconnect it switch it off so that the battery doesn't run out the battery is built in here cr2032 if it runs out you have to get a new one but there's a spare battery inside so you have two okay and so that's it for the review of my new tripod Hope you enjoyed this video, do give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. And also for more information you can leave a comment in the comment section below. Bye!